hello viewers in today's video i am going to show you how to root on a rate you need to tap seven times on build number to enable developer options then go in developer options and enable oem unlock and also enable um, usb debugging once you have enabled oem unlock you need to connect your phone in uh, fast boot mode In order to enter fast boot mode you need to type command on your PC ADB devices and uh, it should detect your phone if you have enabled USB debugging then type ADB space reboot bootloader and uh, then press enter and your phone should reboot to fast boot mode and you can see FRP is showing unlock and phone is showing locked. Now we need to unlock the bootloader of this phone. I have already obtained uh, bootloader unlock code uh, for my phone. And now I'm going to use this code to unlock the bootloader. Simply copy your bootloader unlock code. And uh, in command window you need to type fastboot space oem space unlock space and then enter your uh, bootloader unlock code viewers uh, this code is unique for every device after pressing enter your device uh, should uh, warn you that uh, are you sure you want to unlock use volume up to select yes then press power button and uh, your phone uh, should uh, perform a factory reset and uh, this message should appear that your device has been unlocked and cannot be trusted so we are going to wait until this uh, reset completes Okay, device just booted up. Now I need to quickly pass through the configurations. Viewers, you can skip uh, each and everything you don't need to set up. Especially don't set up fingerprints and screen locks. Once you reach uh, home screen, you need to enable USB debugging again. We was one thing I forgot to tell you that uh, you must have SD card installed and now we should uh, copy the super SU file. We was this is a different version which you are seeing in this video. Uh, actually you need to use a different version which I have uh, given in the link of link uh, is given in the description of this video. That link you need to use for your device for uh, for installing super SU. Okay, I have already copied super SU zip file on my SD card now I need to make sure that USB debugging is enabled tap seven times on build number to enable developer options then go in developer options and uh, enable USB debugging again once you have enabled USB debugging then you need to type uh, same command again to enter the re uh, to enter fast boot mode ADB reboot boot loader and uh, press enter phone should enter uh, fast boot mode again now we are going to flash twrp recovery on uh, on this phone simply uh, open the cmd window and uh, type there fast boot flash fast boot space flash space recovery and then drag the twrp recovery file on this uh, cmd screen 
simply click that uh, TWRP recovery image and uh, drop on the CMD screen and press enter. It should start flashing the TWRP recovery. Once the recovery has been flashed, you need to disconnect phone from uh, PC and then hold volume up and power key simultaneously. Keep holding both keys even after reboot. Just keep holding until it shows you the TWRP recovery. So I am going to hold volume up and power key. Just keep holding even uh, when it uh, shows you the message that device has been unlocked. Keep holding, keep holding. After this screen, uh, TWRP should appear. Okay, TWRP recovery appeared. Now we need to swipe to allow modifications. Then uh, we need to actually first we need to back up. Uh, boot and system partition this backup is very important if by mistake anything goes wrong or uh, the root does not work for your phone then you will be able to restore your phone back to working condition by restoring these partitions so here i am uh, creating a backup of uh, boot file and uh, the system partition so it is going to take a few minutes I will try to skip the video because uh, I don't need to show all this process. Backup almost uh, completed. Now I am waiting for uh, TWRP recovery. Okay, now after the backup, you need to go back and tap on install, then tap on select storage, and then choose micro SD card. Press OK. And here you need to select 2.79 uh, Super SD version and uh, then swipe to install. This uh, flashing will take uh, 30 to 40 seconds only once installation of super su has been completed you can uh, reboot uh, your phone straight away okay simply reboot and press do not install and uh, now phone should uh, reboot Okay, phone has just booted up and you can see Super SU has been installed and uh, now I am going to install Root Checker app to make sure that root access is uh, properly installed. Open Root Checker and tap on Verify Root, Grant Root Access and yes, it is showing Root Access has been properly installed on this device. Thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe to my channel for more amazing videos in future.